日前，立法院三读通过海空特别预算，国防部也首度公开了代号“雄升飞弹”的地对地巡弋飞弹。为了这样的飞弹正式服役之后，能够有效加强台海战力。The Shongshan missile is the first surface-to-surface -surface cruise missile made public by the ROC Taiwan Ministry of National Defenses, and is expected to be integral in strengthening Taiwan's combative power and defenses. According to the MND, the surface-to-surface -surface cruise missile is a long-range, precision-guided weapon. Its projectile range is estimated to be between 1,000 and 1,200 kilometers. The missile can also reach the inland areas of China. The MND added that mass production of the missiles will be around 100, with the completion of the new missile production plant commissioned by the National Zhongshan Institute of Science and Technology, also called NCSIST, in June. The number of missiles in Taiwan will increase greatly. 真诚型这个巡弋飞弹，哎，主要是可以打击这个对手，哎，敌军这个高价值的地面目标，可能像指挥中心啊、重要的弹药库啊，或者油库等等一些重要的军事高价值的设施。Though expectations for Shongshan missiles are high, the Ministry of Defense are still keeping silent on its exact production goals. According to reports, the Shongshan missiles will share a production line with previous Shongfeng missiles, and their combined production number is estimated to be around 81 per year. Now, with the addition of the NCSIST new production plant, they will be able to make 131 per year, though the exact number of Shongshan missiles is still unknown. With the Shongshan missiles, Taiwan will be able to provide a better defense against any possible attacks as one of the islands in the first island chain in East Asia. As certain parts of the Shongshan missiles were provided by the U.S., many also believe that they are allowing Taiwan to be armed with such missiles to prevent any attacks from extending to the second island chain. 猜测到或是推测到它的外形，大概跟美国的这个战斧巡弋飞弹啊非常接近跟类似啊，而且射程也相仿。那其实是美国呃把这种呃雄升飞弹上的关键性的零组件授予台湾之后，其实美国基本上就已经对台湾啊拥有这样一个雄升飞弹，它本身是采取一个默许。As cross-strait tensions grow, Taiwan has also modeled its defense structure after the U.S., and President Tsai Ing-wen has also upped the ante by calling on reservists to train for combat should an attack occur in the near future. TVBS English News.